The Benton Harbor Fruit Market is the largest cash-to-grower wholesale fruit and vegetable market in the world. Five and three. <laughs> Located in Benton Harbor in southwest Michigan, the market provides hundreds of small farmers with a place to sell fresh-picked local fruits and vegetables. It is at the heart of the local food revolution in this place. We know that there is a, a virtual revolution occurring in community-based food systems. But what we haven't focused on um, is how do we transform this incredible interest for three or four months out of the year uh, to an interest that provides accessibility to local foods year-round. At the market this morning are representatives from the kitchen at the Mendel Center at Lake Michigan College. It's been kind of exciting to actually go to the market and see all of the different vegetables and be able to pick out exactly what you want to cook and bring it back here and prepare it. In 2009, the Mendel Center began to purchase and preserve local fruits and vegetables from Benton Harbor fruit market farmers in a move to provide local food year-round to its customers. When we initially started, um, Lee had actually come to us with the idea of not just buying locally, but starting to, to preserve our products to use all year. So how do you take broccoli, and instead of preserving for 30 pounds for your family for the winter, how do you do 300 pounds? The final crop of the 2010 season was cauliflower. Um, we were preserving and putting up uh, local cauliflower um, for the winter, and so we, we uh, have a process where we um, cut it and get it ready to boil for a couple of minutes, blanch it, and then we shock it in ice water. And then we put it on pans to, to drain a lot of the liquid out, uh, the water out. And then we put it in bags and preserve it for the winter. The, the things that we use the most, we use a cryovacker um, that, that wasn't very expensive. It cost about $2,500. Um, and then we rent out freezer space with a local cold, cold storage company. And it's $15 a pallet. Um, beyond that, all the money that we spent has been um, spent on labor and, and then back into buying the produce. We have preserved um, green beans. We have green beans in our freezer. We have broccoli in our freezer. We have the uh, uh, sour cherries in our freezer, strawberries, blueberries. Actually, after looking at the money, we spent um, a surprising number less with our general distributor in the past year. Um, and with that, we took that money's now been spent locally, and we've also saved a lot of money. We love it. We, I, it's, it's the next best thing from, from being fresh. I mean, we, we, the things that we do get in, if we have to buy it from a large purveyor, does not even begin to compare in flavor and texture, appearance, and we get a lot of really good comments back from our guests, so we love it. I think the principal significance of the Mendel Center and Lake Michigan College uh, in, and their commitment to a community-based food system is that it opens the door for others to realize that if they can do it, we can do it.